Hello, hello. Hey, how's it going? And welcome back to Jason's General. We're doing another best of one of... Sorry, I just had to take a minute here. We opened Arabella. Best of one of... um. What is this format called again? Dustmorn. Uh, I'm going to take this Arabella. It's a little bit... Have a risky pick, maybe. But I think this card is just good enough that... It's something that you can first pick. <clears throat> this is kind of a bad pack, if I'm being completely honest. Arabelle is good, and then... I don't know. I don't know what else I really like here. Fear of Surveillance is decent. I do like white. Glassworks is okay. I guess it's a fine pack, but... <clears throat> Let's slam pick the Arabella here. I haven't been in Boros, actually, at all this format. Fear of Abduction, as well as Oblivious Bookworm, which I think just has to be the better card. This card is just a mythic uncommon. So I'm going to take that over the fear. I think that's totally fine. I'd rather I think I'd rather be blue, green than white, red. And if we look back at pack one, I did take a screenshot. Oh my god, I have so many tabs open. I always do this to myself. Why do I always do this to myself? Oh, did I just close the screenshot? No, I didn't. If we look back at pack look back at pack one, if there's any the only blue or green card that we actually want is like there was really nothing. I would take like the piranha fly. But, um, anyway, uh, another good one. Glimmer is also super good. <sighs> I might just take this Glimmer with the hopes to pick up Glimmer Burst th down the line. And then maybe splash for one of the other colors. I think <laughs> I think that's totally fine. We'll just take all the sites on signposts on comments and then kind of just see what happens. Anyway, uh, this is activated abilities. These are all triggered abilities. So the Marvin doesn't really do anything for us. And now, what do we like? Hmm. Nothing. This pack seems. Pretty mediocre. I don't know what cards this plays with, plays well with. I'm really unsure. But I think I'm, for now, I'm just going to go for the cheerleader. It's a fine two drop. And can play in multiple archetypes, so. Oh, uh, Valvagoth, Velga, Velgavoth Lair is a decent one. This is a really late liver die. God damn. Gosh darn. Um, hmm. Actually, Survivor is really nice. I'm going to go for that, I think. I think that's fine. We could take the land. Or even just Terramorphic Expanse if we wanted to. No, actually, this plays really well with bookworms. Let's let's do this. Cathartic parting. Uh, hmm. Black is seemingly open, pretty wide open. Um, so I'm definitely gonna grab some of these removal spells. I believe. I'd like the centipede, but like. If black's just going to be this open, <laughs> then obviously we should take it. I'm ha happy to splash for it. And maybe main deck black if, like, we keep seeing such good cards. Um, I think Manifest Dread is great. The three mana 
spell there is also solid, but we do need some two drops and um, Manifest Dread plays really well with the Bookworm. Centipede to get our fixing for whatever our third color is. Fear of Dark's okay. Has like a one of, but just do this. There's that Piranha Fly from pack one. I don't mind Duskmorn Domination, but not something that I'm super thrilled about either. I think Piranha Flies are decent. What is this? Whenever an enchantment enters, it gets plus two in lifelink. Card's okay. Um, I think I'm just going to take the red-blue land. And then that kind of leaves us a little bit open. To be able to splash. Shepherd. There's a red-black land now. I guess if we care about Delirium at all, we could take the bear trap. I think I'm just going to go Shepherd or Spirit here, though, because I... I don't know. I really like the Glimmer, so kind of leaves us the most open, just taking the Spirit to be able to get the land if we need to. Another okay removal spell. What is this one? Being in your end step, exile the top card of your library and you played this turn. I don't know if that card's good. Chainsaw is definitely really good. So is Rescue. Um, survivor's decent. I like underwater tunnel. Do we want to splash for the chainsaw? <sighs> Maybe not. I might just take like tunnel or root wise. Hmm. Again, we could take this. Charred, charred foyer. It feels a little bit slow. Uh, last minute change of decision. Last minute change my decision. I should say. Um. Hmm. Another Manifest Dread seems okay. Could just take the removal too, though. It's not the worst. Some hard removal in black. Zealot's okay. I think another Manifest Dread feels good here. I guess splashing the chainsaw was definitely a possibility. I don't know. There's a dragon fire now. Hmm. Yeah, maybe I should have taken chainsaw. Maybe, 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 maybe. Uh, black red land feels good though, especially with the double removal now. Otherwise, role model is very good. A little bit awkward to splash though, because it doesn't do much unless you get it down on turn two. So I'm just going to take the land for now. Leyline of the Void. Monstrous Emergence. It's good. Don't mind the intervention. I'd like like a big one, one of the, one, like a bigger creature would be nice too. Flesh is decent. I think I'll just grab. Hmm. Are we over prioritizing removal? A little bit. <sighs> I do like break down the door, but. Yeah. 
Yeah, I'm probably just going to take Break Down the Door. It's so good with this. Discard a card. If you need step, you may draw a card if you do discard a card. And if you if a face down permanent entered the battlefield or flipped, then you get to keep the card in your hand instead of discard it. Midnight Mayhem. Hmm. Just a bunch of other stuff that we can't play. Awesome. Underwater is nice. Land wouldn't be terrible. Um, I do like the underwater tunnel. Underwater tunnel quite a bit. Although, perhaps we're just supposed to be some other colors. We're not really seeing many blue cards. I'm starting to realize. Um, what was in that pack that we could change? Hmm. Well, let's think about this now. What, like, what what are our colors? Manifest dread, certainly. Prowlers are like okay, something that you can run depending on what you're playing with it. So a white card. We have some decent white cards too. Hmm. Entity tracker. This card is sweet when you have enchantments. We don't have a ton of those though. <sighs> I kind of want to take it. We have like no creatures. I do like fear of exposure as well. And seeing as we have very little enchantment, maybe we just go for this. Ooh. We've seen this card twice now. People are not catching on to the fact that it's Potentially, you're not catching on to the fact that it's really good. I, I don't, I don't know. But I will happily take it, and then probably just cut blue out for the most part. Honestly, I'm happy to just splash for the bookworm, though. Ethereal armor is great. This is also a demon. When it enters, you may discard any of the cards. When you do. How many creatures get minus two, minus two? Seems good to me. Might as well take it, yeah. Miasma Demon. Yeah, seems like seems like we made the right decision. It's been a weird draft though, I must say. Finale, Final Vengeance, I mean, not Finale. Final Vengeance over another Tunnel's okay. Well, during Gym is okay. We don't have like a ton of things that we want to sacrifice to Final Vengeance, but it's good removal. Maybe we just have too much removal, actually. Uh, do we take Slasher? Whenever an enchantment you control enters and whenever you fully unlock a room. Yada yada yada. Hmm. Whenever you whenever face down permanent you control enters, and whenever cryptid inspector or another permanent you control is turned face up, put a one one counter on this. This actually feels really good in our deck and we we're desperate for creatures, so Oh, I guess we do have the three manifest dreads. I I'm not considering those. In fact, that's actually really good. We'll take another cryptid though. I feel like it's really good in our deck. <laughs> With all this mana dressing, manifest dressing, <laughs> man, mana fed, <laughs> manifest dread we're doing. Ooh, defiled crypt's kind of 
fun. Yeah, we'll take that. So we effectively have like 13 creatures actually. Not doing too bad. Uh, Terramorphic feels okay with the bookworm. I'm not super down for the cackler, I'm gonna be real. I'll take the anthropede maybe for the sideboard if we go up against like a room deck. Glimmer Burst is nice. I'll, I'll take one of those. Cackling Slasher. Hmm. I honestly don't mind the lifelink here. I think that's going to be pretty good. And the deck basically built itself. I think we're I think we're in a pretty good spot. We got three sources for blue, a terramorphic expanse, and a draw spell. This draw spell is something you're going to want late anyway, so it's like I think it's fine to also splash with our bookworm. And yeah, things feel good. Deck looks good. Let's go to our first game. First match. <laughs> okay, this looks pretty good. We're on the play. Fear of lost teeth. Okay. Cackler. I think we just go inspector into inspector. We could trade off, but I think flipping the cackler is going to be pretty good. Possessed, go. Okay, they're in reanimate for sure. Alright, we're turning this face up.
Possessed Goat is dead. They bought him their overlord. Or they ditch, they dump their overlord into the grave. Overlord of Boiler Villages. It's a good card. It's a very good card. What do they have? Like a board, board wipe? I think they might. I'm thinking it might have a board wipe. Feels like it. They're gonna kill everything that's untapped. Nice. Hey, bad boy, bad boy. Now we draw a discard. Beautiful. Oh, they can just, he can just, he can just. He can just kill? Oh no, he can just kill my 5-4? <laughs> Damn, they, they, they're, they're, they're definitely in our pod and they definitely got all the good reanimate cards. So that's really annoying. <sighs> I thought this was 5-5 five, five for some reason. I wasn't paying attention. Draw, discard. Let's see if they want to trade. Yep, 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 yep. All right, well, hopefully they can't bring it back because that would probably be GG's. Demonic Council, jeez. Okay. So they just basically demonic tutored us, that's fine. What do we think they got? Another reanimate spell, maybe? <sighs> Alright, we're gonna take four.
I guess I didn't need to flip this, but... They deal four to us, and then we take four. But we gain... We, we're gonna go to one. Oh, no. Oh, we're just... Never mind. We're just dead. Okay, uh... Jeez. That was a bit of a... Rough time. They have two liver dies, and they have a demonic council. So we just need to survive, I guess. I don't think we have much to sideboard in. Okay, we just need to draw some creatures, and this hand is perfect. Alright, play our forest, and then play our island. Innocuous rat, alright. We'll take one. And hopefully hit some creatures soon. Hopefully hit some creatures soon. Take one again. Damn, that's not the indestructible card. That's kind of sad. Well, we can bring it back. <laughs> All right. Take one. My turn again. I kind of want them to just use the removal on this as well. Again. So I'm just going to play this out. And then we'll hold up our survivor. We know they have a lot of removal. Plane cycling. Alright, we know they have the board wipe. So if they use it, they just sweep their 2-2 two -two anyway.
Um, I'm just gonna save this, gain some life. Seems fine. They lose their liver die, and they use the liver die. That's great for us. Okay. I think we just get another green. I'm very worried about a board wipe. So I'm not going to play anything else. Got it. Got him. All right, they're just going to grab their, like, overlord, which is fine. I mean, I don't know if it's fine, but... Definitely what they're doing. So what does that mean for us? Not really sure. We need them to play another creature. Deals damage used with the power of the target creature you controlled. Okay, that's good. Oh, they got Shroud Stomper. Okay. You know what? I'm actually going to play... Hmm. I think I'm going to play Survivor first. Then we can tap it down next turn. If they play a big creature. Ooh. Hmm. Why do they just have... Okay, that's fine. When this enters, target player sacrifice a creature other than enchanted creature. I guess it's basically just top deck now, but we have the upper hand with our 5-4. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 7, 8. We have 8 lands. Oh, nice. That's, they gave us a 2-2 two -two with that. <laughs> That's funny. Rats.
All right, they put mirth in the grave. I'm looking forward to the surveil. Hopefully they don't play a creature. Or have removal. Come on. That's a good hit. So I think this is just like a land or something. In for five. We'll just say go. Hold up the break down the door. Say go. What a shame. Um, just bring back another thing. God darn. Come on. <laughs> Man, they got a good deck. I shouldn't... Uh, yeah. This is not the type of deck you want to go into the long game with, but they just have a really good deck. Like... <sighs> Sad. Board wipe. Two great reanimate targets. It was close. <sighs> what a shame, what a shame. All right, match number two. I think we can make this work. Manifest Dread. Don't do it. Okay, that's fine.
Ah, it was an anthropede. Good to know. Let's play ourselves a slasher here. I find it really funny that they wanted to shuffle that so bad. There's just it just wasn't a good card. <laughs> um Hmm. We had two options. I was considering exiling this so they can't get a manifest plus three three, but Kill their survivor. I'm okay with I'm okay with that. Alright, they get a surveil, it's fine. Conductive machete. Machete. Is this just like a, a two two normally? Let's trade it off. Bring it back. And then give it a counter. That's okay. There's a couple lines. I like that one. gonna say they're gonna surveil okay it's gonna say I feel like they've forgotten about their weight room but maybe not Let's draw. Let's discard. Oh, okay. Well then, I think we just win, right?
Nice. Playing pretty, like we were, we were on the offense for a majority of the game there, so worked out. Hmm. Kind of don't mind the cackler. Might just cut an infectious dread. <laughs> Alrighty, this is good. Play our top plan to start. I think we just go straight into Manifest Dread. I think they, they missed their land drop, that's good. Inspector Gadget, let's go. Centipede. All right, land, swing both. like that trade. That seems like a weird one for them to, to actually trade, but I'll take it. Cackling Slasher. Oh, buddy. Non-Avatar. Scary. They didn't really hit much, though. Pending five. This seems very mediocre. Flesh borrow. Ooh. Let's just go straight into demon time. Demon time, it's demon time. Hopefully they don't just have like hard removal right off the bat, that would suck. Okay. It's a fine trade to me. Swing both. In for six, beautiful. They lose two, we gain two. We can flash in our amalgam. <sighs> sure. Nice.
fools. <laughs> Down to three they go. Oh no, wait, we lose we lose life now, never mind. Hmm. Hold on a second. Okay. Alright, we're gonna start losing some life here, so we're not liking that. We're not loving that. But. That's okay. Let them swing. This is gonna unlock on their end step. We kill it. Just prevent. Present lethal. Okay. Now we can exile this. Manifest Dread is okay. They're gonna take some damage. Make another 2-2. Two -two. Then we play our own Cackling Shackler, shackler again. Taking some life, of course, but what are you going to do? Okay. Do we double block? I think so. All right, let's play our own cackling shackler. 
manifest. It's a pretty good hit. And we can play Survivor. We're going to take two, go to three. I think we're... Can okay, I have a counter spell? Sure. Sure, 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 sure. That's a really good hit. That's a really good draw. I don't think we can lose. I don't think we can lose. I don't want to wait for my life to be over. Alright, they're going to manifest. We might have lost if we didn't, if we didn't. We didn't draw the survivor, but we did. What's the point of that? Hmm. All right, cool. Good GG's. One on one. We've done like every draft has just been one on one. It's been kind of annoying, but it is what it is. Last game. All right, I'm definitely taking the play. It's a great hand. Put up my guns to six. Clockwork Percussionist, my favorite card. <clears throat> I think we just go Cryptid. They probably have like removal or first strike. Okay. Yep. No box. <sighs> this has vigilance, so... Alright, we know they have removal. Boom, boom. We don't want to give them that extra card. Sure. That's fine. Toby. Damn. 
I'm not even sure what to do. They're going so aggressive on us. Roller coaster. Oh my god. At least we can just block the 4-4. Four four. And we could also just not block the 4-4. Four four. Oh, come on. <sighs> Another turn inside out. Wow. Couldn't go any worse than that, really. <laughs> uh, I don't think I'm gonna play sporadic. Like, doesn't seem very good in our deck. And I'm just gonna bring in another slasher again. Should have probably should have just done that in the first place. <laughs> All right, <clears throat> take the play. This hand's fine, it's obviously not as fast as I'd want it to be, but not much we can do about that. Glimmer light, okay. They have the plus one plus zero card again. Plus three plus O. Oh. Plus three plus O. Oh. Well, we know they have it. They might have two. Or they just have that. Nope. I know you got it there, buddy. So what do we do? Uh, man. Block, kill that. Block, kill that. Yeah, block here, kill that. Since we know they're going all in. <clears throat> hmm. We really need a land. <clears throat> play this another glimmer light damn I think they have it I think they have it <sighs> Damn, they do. Ah, uh, it's okay. 
Can't win them all. It was we were still in such a bad place. Like it didn't it didn't even matter if the block was changed. Like I was considering just blocking, but then it was like we were basically just done. Scrubbed anyway. So it didn't go so good. Um we played against some really good decks. The aggro deck was was just phenomenal, and then we had uh, another deck that was just a really good reanimate deck that also kicked our butts. So, yeah, kind of unfortunate, but it is what it is. Sometimes that's just the way that what it, the way that it goes. I feel like we just didn't have a lot of raw power. That's something that I'd probably change going forward. It's just like even just bringing in like one of the six sevens or something. These inspectors seem okay if you have multiple. Manifest dreads. We never really got to like get that much value out of them, but they seem okay. Like they they definitely don't seem unplayable. So yeah, deck was fine. It is what it is. If you liked what you watch, please comment, like, subscribe, stay tuned for the next one. Still got two fifty in a pack. It is what it is. Have a nice one. Cheers. Bye.